Having the best trading tools is important to a professional Forex and crypto trader. Maverick Currencies believes TradingView is one of the best tools for traders. Since our traders trade our capital and keep 70 to 80% of profits, it's essential to have the best trading tools, which is why we substantially train all our traders to use TradingView to maximize their profits. We're happy to share our expertise with the public to make you a better Forex or crypto trader. If you're ready to be a professional Forex and crypto trader, click on the apply link in the video description. Now on to our tutorial. Hello Maverick Traders, Imri here and in this TradingView tutorial, we're going to be taking a look at uh, what watch list distribution looks like. So I put together this watch list of just a bunch of different stocks here. I titled it the 2023 portfolio just because and now I'm gonna show you how to make use of this distribution feature. So in the top right hand corner of the portfolio, there is this button called advanced view. So when I click advanced view on this watch list, it's gonna bring up this uh, little screen here. Now what's really cool about this screen is that it breaks down my watch list in terms of the different industries in which I'm holding these stocks in the watch list, as well as the broader sectors as well. So, um, I'm also going to get a snapshot of, of all sorts of financial data here and I can even make custom groupings. I can, uh, if, if I have something other than stocks, then I can see it by, by different symbol types uh, and, and different market classes and so on. So this is a very handy feature so you can see at a glance how well balanced your watch list is or how concentrated your watch list is depending on what it is you want to do. And then of course you can also share that list uh, by copying the link to it. You can of course share it on Twitter or Facebook as well. Um, now I'm going to show you a more diversified portfolio with different market classes including cryptocurrencies, commodities, cryptocurrencies. Um, and you can see here that in terms of sectors, I, I've only got two sectors because I don't have that many individual stocks here, just finance and, and tech services. But as far as the symbol types go, you can see that I have a lot of uh, currency pairs in there, I have some cryptocurrencies, some major indices, futures markets, I have some funds, commodities, bonds, and then very few individual stocks, just two as you can see. So I hope this feature overview is helpful for you. And if you have any questions about how to use TradingView, just let us know. All right, that's it for me, traders. Talk to you next time.